Today's morning minute, victory, victory. How do you achieve a 30, 60, and or a hundredfold increase? Is it your desire to be fruitful and increase at a 30, 60, and or a hundredfold increase? How do you live in victory versus defeat and fear? What does the Word of God say is holding you back from living a fruitful, fulfilled life? We read in Mark 4, chapter 4, verse 19. Then the cares and anxieties of the world and distractions of the age and the pleasure and delight and false glamour and deceitfulness of riches and the craving and passionate desire for other things creep in and choke and suffocate the word and it becomes fruitless. Here is the six items which are causing defeat, fruitlessness, and a lack of fulfillment. The cares and anxieties of the world, the distractions of the age, the pleasures and delight of life, the allure of glamour, the deceitfulness of riches, the craving and passionate desires for more things. And in Mark chapter 4, verse 20, And those sown on the good, well-adapted soil are the ones who hear, hear the word and receive and accept and welcome it and bear fruit. Some 30 times as much as was sown, some 60 times as much, and even a hundred times as much. So what are the characteristics of being fruitful? They hear the word of God. They receive the word of God. They accept the word of God. They welcome the word of God. They bear fruit because of hearing, receiving, accepting, and welcoming the word of God. Are you experiencing fruitfulness and victory through the word of God in your life? And in 1 Corinthians 2, uh, verse 12 in the NFI, what we have received is not the spirit of the world, but the spirit of who is from God, so that we may understand what God has freely given us. Through Jesus Christ, we have victory. Our victory is in Jesus, through the blood of Jesus Christ. Live, live in your identity in Christ. Amen and amen.